What's up, YouTube? Today, we have another, another Duke Duke maintenance video. My Duke Duke collection has slimmed down a tiny bit. I've given a couple away as gifts. People never know what to think of them. Because they're, uh, first of all, they're slip joints. They're a big slip joint, and they're just kind of exotic and weird looking. Oh, by the way, this is a koozie from Gilly Customs, Gilly's Custom, brass out of Arizona, friend of the show. I'm drinking a, one of these. It's actually a pretty decent beer. If you, I mean, like, I don't, I don't know if I drink it every day. But I threw this into uh, a pocket and just kind of diddy bopped around all day. And you can see it kind of built up a little bit of oxidization. So we need to knock that down. Don't want that getting out of control. Got the election coming up. Today is the 30th of October. In a few short days, we will all go out and vote, except for me and roughly 55% of the population. If I did vote, I would write in Gigi Allen, the spirit animal of this channel. But now I'm just over it. I don't think there's a political solution and... Uh, that's radical speak for do more cardio. We're going to have to riot at some point. The reason I'm using my finger, I want to maximize the, uh, the usefulness of every little grain of whatever and whatever this is. And it'll get absorbed by... So let's see where we're at. Believe it or not, I think that that might be it. We'll take it a little further. I mean, I don't. When it comes to the Duke, I do not really. I'm not a stickler for, you know, is this totally clean? Um, they're made to be used, so it's not, anyway, cheers, cheers to everybody. I'm just off work, so it makes sense that I would have a beer rather than, I'm not like in the middle of the day. I realize it's a Wednesday. Let's continue. So we got this guy. Again, this is the best stuff. It's called the Magic Cream. Magic, or what is it? Blue Polish Cream. Metal pol Metal Polish Cream. Blue Magic, we got it. I, I knew somewhere the blue was on here. Um, it's pretty much the only stuff I buy now. I genuinely do think it's better than other stuff. So, but look, if you, you know, you've used one thing your whole life, you don't want to change. That's fine. Be very careful doing this. Um, that edge, you always got to respect the knife. Take a look at the rest. There is the God of Chaos, the Duke. 
Actually, Duke Duke is knife. I think Duke is knife. So this would be knife knife. No, you know, I, I paid, I think under 40 bucks for this and I've had no regrets ever. It's just not something that's going to fail. I will say this spring on this broken very nice. It's chilled out. So it's less like a gator snap and more just like a strong pull. And why did I throw it in my pocket? I was going to eat and I didn't want to use the terrible knife that uh, the restaurant I was going to was gonna offer me. And it's just not the same as, you know, if I, like for instance, I've been carrying this. Pretty much ever since I got it and it is very useful. I'm gonna make another video about it. Um, but like, this is kind of a nice knife and I get some people hate serrations, which is dumb. Um, on a work knife anyway, I get it. If it's not your favorite, I don't have serrations on hardly any knives except for that one, but I didn't want to get that knife dirty and stuff. And so like, you know, this knife is, is ready to be made dirty. This is the natural patina. I think from food, it could be from really anything. Comes up when we got this lanyard. So yeah, again, if uh, you're looking for a knife that you're not gonna have to baby, this would be it. I realize uh, guys like Nick Shabazz, they want thumb flipper, they want a lot of different stuff, but I'll tell you one thing about Nick, that guy jet sets way too much to have a knife in his pocket all the time. That's just a fact. Also Medford backed him down, I guess. I think I heard Medford say that, like that Nick was talking some smack and <laughs> go figure, Medford, the former Marine infantryman was not very appreciative of that. Anyway, that's about all she wrote for this one. Thanks for sticking with me to the end. I hope you folks have a good rest of your day. Bye now.